Hi, my name is Carmel Alipio. I'm an associate in the Raleigh office. Today, I have the pleasure and opportunity to speak with Carrie Stanton, a partner in our Charlottesville office. Carrie has just celebrated an impressive 10 years at Williams Mullen. And in that time, she's grown her M&A practice, grown her family, served as an adjunct professor at the University of Virginia School of Law, and was promoted to partner. Carrie, that is an impressive feat. How do you manage your time managing it all? You know, one thing that I try to do on that front is really try to get a sense of when things are really urgent and when they might not be as urgent. So if, if I have a deal closing, that's urgent. I know that I need to be available. I need to be checking my phone, but I don't have a deal close every day of the year. And, and I have a good sense of when things are in a place that I might have a little bit more breathing room. And, and when that's the case, I, I lean into that. I, I really use that downtime to recharge, reconnect with friends and family, and I take it very seriously. Um, I, I actually do spreadsheets before I go on vacation that I work on with my legal assistant, trying to track every matter that I have going, other attorneys who are working on it with me, the clients who might reach out and who might be a support person at the firm in the event something comes up while I'm away that's not incredibly urgent to the point that I, I need to jump on it. Um, you know, we work in a firm with a lot of smart people and I'm not the only one and probably you're not the only one. None of us is the only one that can do any particular project. And so supporting each other in that way so that we can all have that time to recharge is really important. It sounds like you've created a really healthy balance between helping your clients reach the success that they need and taking time for yourself and encouraging that type of healthy boundary behavior at work. But I'm sure you still feel some added pressure with a young child at home. Absolutely. Um, having a little one at home is, is a huge time commitment and it is emotionally draining and can be really exhausting and is also just so incredibly fulfilling. Caregivers historically have been disproportionately female, but more and more men and, and our colleagues of all genders and gender identities are, are taking on that caregiver role more and more. So it's, it's a topic that, that we all care about and that is important to all of us. And so I think it's really important to share space with each other in these conversations. You know, this isn't just a women's issue you know, coming together to, to support each other in a welcoming and supportive community. And I'm, I'm glad to, to be able to say that that is here at Williams Mullen and, and those spaces are available. I think supporting each other and, and understanding that we're all in this together is, is the first step. Thank you, Carrie, so much for sharing your thoughts and for encouraging us to really focus on our overall well-being and health.